USS Kearney is returning home to Naval Station Mayport. The vessel classified as a destroyer was deployed for nearly eight months. It's credited for conducting defensive strikes in the Middle East. News for Jack's reporter Khalil Maycock shares tomorrow's homecoming will be special. You never know being in uh, uncharted territory what the, the situation may be at any given day. Jennifer Carroll is a retired lieutenant commander, aviation maintenance officer in the U.S. Navy. She's describing why the homecoming for this ship, the USS Kearney, will be so important. The ship will finally be back at Naval Station Mayport after being deployed for nearly eight months. Ten days after it left here, Hamas attacked Israel, putting the Middle East at war. <laughs> This is video of launches from three naval ships, one being the USS Kearney. And in this video from earlier this year, this is when Iranian-backed Houthis fired a ballistic missile. The Kearney responded and helped the civilian crew on board. No one died, but attacks only grew. The Houthis launched missiles and drones into the Red Sea, targeting vessels from over 40 countries around the world. The Kearney helped combat all of this. They destroyed Houthi-launched weapons and conducted two defensive strikes against Houthi targets in Yemen. All work Carol described as heroic. Describe how important their work that they do overseas is. Well, when you have you have a battle group and you have a number of things that's going on out there, you have the you you have your your surveillance that's going on, you have your counterattack that's going on, you have your protection that's going on, and it's like it's like a city on the sea with all the particulars that's needed to defend and guard and protect. Quill Maycock, Channel 4, The Local Station.